you can live for yourself, you can live with pride, you can live with all, all these kind of things, but at the end of the day, God is God. And God will not be moved, and God will not be put down, and God will not be broken. God is God and He's sovereign over the universe, He's sovereign over the nations, He's sovereign over the mountains, He's sovereign over the universe, He created this universe, and He created you, and He commands everybody to repent and believe on Him. And if we repent and believe on Him, if we turn away from our old life and believe on Him, we will be saved. But if we refuse to bow, if we refuse to believe, Jesus says, there will be weeping and gnashing of teeth. Amen. What we sow is what we reap. What we reap is what we sow. And if we sow those things that are not right, we will reap judgment. A judgment, a fearful judgment. There is a fearful judgment, a fearful judgment in the hands of an angry God who every day is not happy the way we live and the things that we do. He's not happy when we lie. He's not happy when we steal. He's not happy when we sleep around. He's not happy with it. And he commands everybody everywhere to repent. This is his land. Your life is his life. That body that you have is his body. And it is not to be used for sleeping around. It is not for you to be taking drugs. It is not for you to manipulate people. That body you have is God's body. And he commands you to repent and to believe in Him and trust Him as your Lord and Savior. To repent and believe in Him. Not your body. Your body is His body. Your body is His body. It is not your body. God has given you a body and that body is to be used by you for glory of God. Not for the glory of yourself, but for Him. And He commands you everywhere to repent and know His love in your life. The wonderful love of God. I committed attempted armed robbery. And God saved me. And God can save you today. It can give you a new life, a new future, a new purpose, a new blessing, a new way. As Jesus says you must be born again. You can't be born again by getting bladdered and drunk at the weekend. Why not? You can't be born again by Why taking not? drugs. You can by being born again in the Holy Spirit. The flesh, the flesh gives birth to flesh, the spirit gives birth to spirit. Jesus is the only way Getting heaven, drunk sir. will not do you any good. Explain yourself. Well, I'll explain. I'll explain myself. You can't just stand there and go. I'll, blah, ex blah, 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 I'll blah, explain blah. myself. Explain yourself. Let me explain myself. Well, explain yourself. If I get drunk, you don't need to shout. If I get I'm drunk, so if I get drunk, yeah, if I get drunk, will it do my livers good? Probably not. If I get drunk, really, really drunk. Is there a good chance I'll get sick? Well, it depends on you. Yeah. 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 So, what is better? To get drunk, do my liver in, and get sick, or, Jesus says, you must be born again. And born again is when God, the Holy Spirit, comes into your life. What you're telling me is, Joy. don't get drunk. No. <laughs> Let God in your life and change you. Let the Holy Spirit come in and change okay, you. I'm, I'm quite open, God. Amen. Oh Amen. Do you want to give your life to Jesus today? No, you don't have to give me any money. However, it's free. It's free. It's free. It's free. It's free. I quite like going to the and every drink with my It's okay to drink, but not to get drunk. I'm always drunk. Well, it's, it's okay. However, I work hard. Yes, yes. To earn my money. To spend my money how I choose. Yes, but not to get drunk. Why not? Because God tells you to be transformed by the renewing of your mind. He tells you to trust Him as your Lord and Savior. <laughs> but I, I like, it's nice to I, meet I, you, I sir. Quite, nice I, quite, I quite like God. Amen. And, I'm, 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 uh, and He I'm, likes you. And uh, I'm quite akin to the God thing. Yeah. However, yeah. I go to work, I earn a lot of money, yeah. and then I come home. I like to go to the pub. And I like to get drunk. There's nothing wrong going to the pub, and there's nothing wrong having a drink. Jesus turned into the water. Kieran and Jason are witnessing to men in Buxton. God bless the Lord. Amen. We take our mind off God. So, the thing is, first of all, trust Jesus as your Lord. And then, and then when you trust Him, start to live for Him. So that means, so that means you can still go to the pub and have a pint, but not get drunk.
because why not? Because you need to love God with all your mind. You can't. Why can't you? Why can't? So you can get drunk. Can you love God if you're drunk out of your head? Why not? Well, what happens to your mind when you get drunk? I usually go to sleep. You, you lose control of your mind. Yeah, perhaps do. That's not stupid. You see what I mean? So, but if, but, but, so, so what I'm saying is, uh, when you come to know so Jesus... So I can't be a god person if I get drunk? No, you can if you turn away from it. Why? Why would you want to turn away from it? Well, Jesus says you must be born again. Why? <laughs> Being born again. Why? 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 Well, let me explain. You put alcohol in you and it poisons your mind. Right. Yeah? If you put God in you, it refreshes your mind. And so, okay. So right, let, right, 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 let, right, let me God, stop you there. Let, 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 let me stop you there. Well, let the Holy Spirit So come. I've got God in me already. Yeah. yeah. And that's your new nature, being born again. I've got God in me already. Being born again, yeah. I know I've got God in me. Of the Holy Spirit. So I can then go in the mill to you yeah. and have 15 pounds. Does that mean that God has left me? No. What, what happened then? No. If you come to know what Jesus, happened then? Well, let me explain to you. If you come to know Jesus explain today, me then. if you come explain to Jesus, me. yeah, if you come to Jesus and you come become born again, yeah. Why do we need to be born again? So that the that, right? no, in between God being in me and going in the middle. No. When you're being born again, the Spirit of God comes in and gives you love, joy, peace. I've already got God in me. Yeah. Enough. But joy you don't peace. need joy and peace from getting drunk, you get it from God. God gives you the joy, God <laughs> gives you the peace. And guess what? It's cheaper! It's cheaper! It probably is cheaper. It's cheaper! I'll give you that, I will give you that. It's cheaper, mate. It's cheaper. It's, cheaper. All right. it's good to talk well, to you. To be fair, yeah. I've lost your argument. All right, God bless you. I am, 